cleaning, breaking down boxes, gonna vacuum, but I think Danny is on a call. I think he took a half day. He's been hit hard by that cold. I do need to do one more coat of yellow and then seal this. I did make the handle stronger because it was really starting to bend. You can see those ridges. I put some bamboo skewers there. I've just been jumping back and forth with what I'm doing. Like, I'll clean up the toys over here for a minute and then I'll break down another box. And then I'll organize the masks and then I'll break down another box. So, kind of going back and forth, but that's what works best for me for cleaning. I don't know what that says about my brain. The cult is playing and I don't want to get copyright strict, so let's try and go away from the speakers. Anyway, Sebastian's out playing with somebody from the school we haven't played with before. And he's on a street he doesn't normally get to go to on his own, but it's just past his border, so I gave him one time permission. So I'm gonna go back to cleaning and I'll see you later. Five minutes till nine so we need to get to sleep and i think i might wake up normal school hours 
so that I can work a bit before I have to pick up Jax from his sleepover and do lots of cleaning. I did get lots of cleaning done, like organizing, breaking down boxes, dusting some of the tables and cleaning surfaces. But I need to do a lot of vacuuming for sure before people come over. But it looks way better. I still need to clean the desk. It's a hot mess. His side is always a hot mess. My side has been a hot mess for a month and a half from all the projects I've had to do. I'm just trying to keep blades and scissors and rolls of tape off the floor so they just get piled up at the end of each session there. So long day. I did take a little time in the morning to crochet with some tea because I was like draining lots of goo. And then I made myself a brunch, made some for the kids as well. And then got to all the cleaning, 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 cleaning. And then probably around four, I sat down to crochet a little bit more until I needed to get ready to take Jax to a sleepover. I had prepped a bag with a sleeping bag and a pillow and the toiletries and I told him, to pack up his change of clothing and he also wanted to pack his computer i believe so at 5 20 we left he needed to be there at six but danny ordered a pizza to be picked up next to a grocery store that was between here and his friend's house so we went to the grocery store and got a gift card for his friend and a bag of candy had Jax decorate a little gift bag on the way there. So we bought that stuff. I also got more zinc because at the time my throat was hurting, but I think I figured it out. I had accidentally made a caffeinated tea around three o'clock and that irritates my throat when I'm getting over a cold. And also I was getting all dizzy and jittery. So I was like, ah, I had to stop drinking it. Now I feel fine. Well, I'm just back at the drainy feeling. I don't feel like I'm restarting all this cold. But I did buy more zinc, which is not a bad thing. It's on sale right now. And I had to go to the pharmacy and get Danny his Zyrtec because he didn't want to drive anywhere. He actually slept in, but he did work the rest of the day. So yeah, it was grocery store, pharmacy to get the Zyrtec because that's pharmacy only. Buying all the gifty stuff running over to Domino's, picking up their pizza, ran into the parents of one of his other friends that were waiting in line behind us in Domino's, and then drove to the house. I used navigation and found it no problem. And luckily it was their house because the light was, the front door light was off and there weren't any decorations, so it makes me nervous, but it was them. Dropped him off probably got lost thinking, oh, I'll just go in reverse to get out of this neighborhood. Now, instantly ended up in a different cul-de-sac and turned on my navigation to get home. Got home. I ate leftover fried rice from the other night. They ate their pizza. And then we carved pumpkins. You might have seen earlier that I hollowed them all out. Well, our three, just because I knew it was gonna take too long if we had to do that on top of deciding what we were going to carve but i really enjoy doing like meme ones if i'm not inspired i think last year i did totoro because i was inspired too and danny did a cat bus but this year i wasn't really feeling the mario theme they decided to do so i did helmo <laughs> elmo on fire I thought it would be really funny with the light and yeah I'm happy with him but as always I ended up drawing the designs from their stem soles onto their pumpkins they did try to print out the Goomba one and tape it to it but they're like ah, no you're drawing it so I am the stencil drawer they just show me what it looks like and I draw it on the pumpkin so that is my helping job. Sometimes I have to draw it twice because I try to use washable markers so we can clean them off afterwards, but Sebastian kept wiping it off with his hands accidentally, so I ended up having to redraw it in Sharpie. But yeah, it came out good. I'm happy, but that's why it's late. 
And since I'm planning on getting up, I really need to get up to sleep and edit fast. So I'm gonna re regret getting up early, but it's either that or I have to wait till about seven to get up and then I'll be ready around eight and 10 is when I'm supposed to head out to pick up Jack. So I feel like getting up even earlier is good and it'll get me back on track for the remaining three days of the week where I do have to wake up early. So I think that's the plan. Oh, and I think we've settled Halloween. I don't know if I said anything. Yeah, cause this was after I stopped recording. I had mentioned to Sebastian as he was getting to sleep that he should ask his dad to record some of trick or treating because I wouldn't have, I wouldn't be with him to make any videos. And he was like, "Wait, I want you to come with me because I think he really enjoys seeing the videos." So I think we settled on I will take him around our immediate like block, so maybe do 20 minutes, 15 or 20 minutes, and then. I'll come back with him or pass by the house and trade off and I will be the house person and be there for the teens because they probably won't be heading out when it's still light out and Danny will go out with Sebastian for as long as Sebastian wants to but we do need to get in bed so once Danny comes back with him he can take over the door duty and I will do bed so that's the plan all right Good night, stay safe, be kind, and don't forget, wash your hands.